Hello and welcome to my shed. Welcome to part four of the robot arm build. Without further ado, here we go. So now this gets a bit tricky because the pictures aren't very good. And I'm almost certainly going to have to take lots of things to pieces again and again, but never mind. Won't be the first time. So this servo goes like that okay and then there's a servo Bolted on there, yep, which we can do. And then there must be another servo like this, which brings us finally to the home of some sort. Is that just fit on there? I don't know, it's very difficult to tell. That that would use up all the bits. So uh I think the first thing we need to do is fix these two together. So Okay, we've done that. Now, like that. So, ah, no, don't fall for it again. We need to put that bearing in. Have we got another bearing? Bearings go. Where are the bearings? How many bearings did we start with? How many have you used? One, two, three. That's important. Mm, yes, that's important. That's important. Oh, important. Bearing. How do we do it without the bearing? Ah, there she blows. I thought we lost the bearing. Right. Still don't quite know whether these are in the right way. Uh, round. So we're going to go. That's on the middle, isn't it? Not screw, sorry, it is. Bolt, not screw. Sorry about um, all this hesitation, but I really don't know quite. 
what I'm doing. So let's put that in there. That one through there. And do the nut up on the other side. Nice and tight. I'm getting a bit lost now. Um, servo. This servo goes in this way round. And okay, so I need this bit. Oh, want me centers again. Figure out my centers. Okay, so. We've got one centre there, we've got one centre about there, one centre about there. Let's have this centre there. What's the range of motion? One. Okay, straight out and straight back. That's okay, that's 180 degrees, so our range wants to be 90. So this servo, hmm, any particular choice of servo? This servo is going in like that, and we align like that. So when this slots in, there. Fine. Bolt the servo in. Right, that is the fourth servo installed, and I've no idea whether it's right or not, but we're getting there slowly. Two more servos to go. I think I've got to do the fix to the workout this foot next, um, and then we'll do the bring the two together. Okay, so let's put this to one side for a minute. And all its oh dear, and all its um, accoutrements. And let's have a look at that, this now. So, what we've got here is the claw, and it opens based on the servo. So, I don't know where this needs to be. To be honest, where does the servo centre? So it needs to open, uh, sorry, close and open. Close 
one way. So it needs to be like half, halfway. Oh, and then I need to get those correct at the same time. So I've probably got some play. Is that better? And I'm thinking the servo goes. Under there. Yeah, think so. Think that goes under there. Uh, which means uh, that needs to be screwed onto there. Slide that until Ugh. that's better. And we want to be halfway. So what's full? Full is there. Full is there. Closed is there. So about halfway is about forty-five ish. And this is about forty-five ish. Get our servo and centered, so centered, 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 right. Now these screws, those are too big, so I'm going back to these ones here. Right, that is the gripper arm, which is a bit made okay, I suppose, but we'll see how that works. It's quite difficult to tell at the moment, as you might imagine. Gripper arm, the mechanical arm. Now what happens? I'm guessing a servo goes in there. Is that right? Servo hat, and then is that just going to hang on there? Is that hanging on there? Is that fine? I don't know. Okay, let's see what happens. We seem to have used up all the bits now, so. Um, well, that's generally in line, so we should keep the weight that way. Let's just put this in here. Okay, so we have the last connection to go. I'm not massively keen on this connection, but we'll see how it works. So, this servo is centred. Where do we want this? Let's have it... Let's have it like that. So, if we spline that on there... Somewhere here we have a servo 
Oops, straighten, straighten, straighten. There we go. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Won't be able to get to that otherwise. Yep. Straw. Put that on there. This one needs to go on like that. So let's find a bolt. Mm, yeah, bolt. Did I get that from behind there? Okay, number four. I'll take the servo off. Oh, I don't want to take that servo off. That servo's quite important. Mm. Is there anything we can do about that? Look, I can't get to that screw very well. Because it's right behind those pillars. Now, how is that turning? That's not turning. Um, we can try. A different screwdriver. And there we have Wee, 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 wee. Um, the finished product. Tune in next time to um, wire for us to wire it up and um, see what we can do with the controller and see if it needs to be taken all to pieces before we can if all the survey centering isn't correct. So thank you very much for watching and um, I'll see you next time. Thank you very much. Bye bye.